A while back, an interesting idea emerged from the lips of none other than Robert England, the original Freddy Krueger. Yes, the very man who made our childhoods a tapestry of terrifying nightmares. He suggested the iconic Kevin Bacon to step into the shoes of Elm Street's darkest villain. Now, some might raise their eyebrows at this Kevin Bacon, the Footloose star, the man who taught us the six degrees. Think about it. Kevin Bacon possesses a certain depth, gravitas, and intensity that would most likely be perfect for Freddy Krueger. Remember his roles in Mystic River or The Woodsman? Bacon has displayed a broad range of emotions, from profound sorrow to sheer malevolence, suggesting that he could, in fact, bring something fresh, unique, and terrifying to the role of Freddy Krueger. However, a point of contention arises when we consider his age. Admittedly, Kevin Bacon is not the young starlet fresh out of Hollywood's oven, and thus, committing to a sprawling franchise might be a bit too ambitious. But let's dissect that for a moment. Does Freddy Krueger really need to be played by a young man? Isn't his agelessness a part of his terror? Freddy is, after all, a dream demon. Age should be but a minor inconvenience for him as far as the person playing his role is concerned. But for the sake of argument, let's say age is a factor. Well, even then, I truly believe Kevin Bacon could helm at least a trilogy of films, three movies where he delves deep into the psyche of the character, and, who knows, maybe even reinvents Freddy for a new generation. Just imagine the sheer intensity he could bring to the table, a nuanced, layered, and possibly even a sympathetic Freddy perhaps one wrongfully burned for crimes he did not commit, committing to the plot twist the 2010 remake introduced but didn't follow through with. So, I pose the question to you. In this ever-evolving world of reboots, remakes, and cinematic universes, isn't it time for a fresh take on our nightmares? And if so, could Kevin Bacon be the visionary choice to once again make us afraid of falling asleep? At least for a few films? What do you think?